Hey everyone, welcome to a new week. For this video, we're gonna go over the sneaker release for the week of March 28th. So to begin, we're going to go over the US releases for this week. And the first couple of days is really slow, not much happening. And so it really starts on March 30th for the US. And that is going to be the Dunk Low Fossil Rose. Uh, it's gonna come in at $110 and you'll be able to find those on the Nike app. On March 31st, this is a big drop. Uh, you're gonna have the Union LA uh, Dunks uh, in the, both the purple and argon colorways. These things are pretty dope. Definitely go get these. They're gonna be 150 on the site. Uh, Union and I believe Nike will both have these on their site. So definitely cop those if you can. Also, on March 31st, the Sakai and Nike Blazer Low in both the black and white patent colorway will be dropping. Much like the other Sakai Blazers, I doubt these are going to do very much, but they look pretty nice. Uh, you'll, you'll be able to pick these up for $120 um, in the Nike store. And on April 1st, I don't know if it's a April Fool's joke or not, but finally the Halloween dunks are dropping uh, for $110. I hope these finally drop, but they were supposed to drop last year for the Halloween time, but uh, you know, Nike, what can you say? On April 2nd, the Jordan 1 High 85 Georgetown's dropping. Go get these shoes. These are sick. I unfortunately was not able to get any over here in Europe. They were just depleted in moments, so hopefully you guys have better luck than I do. Now to move on to the EU sneaker release for this week. We start off pretty much right away on, on Monday, March 28th, the Nike Dunk Low Team Red is dropping for 100 euro. So, you know, Dunk Lows, I talked about these last week for the US. Uh, I definitely feel like these are gonna get sold out very quickly. I definitely get yours if you can. Uh, they look pretty nice. On March 29th, the Jordan 1 Low Cardinal Red is dropping. These are pretty dope. Uh, you know, it has a, much like what we just talked about with the Team Red, this Cardinal Red is a really nice pop of color. Uh, definitely looks nice. You'll be able to pick those up for 110 at the Nike store. Um, on March 30th, the Nike Dunk Low Paisley is dropping, and that is on the sneaker app itself, and you'll be able to pick those up for 110. On March 30th, the Jordan 7 Sapphire is dropping. I don't, I have mixed feelings about these. They look very nice, but most of the time, sevens do not really sell well. So it'd be interesting to see how these fare. They look pretty nice. So uh, they, they may go pretty quickly, but I have a feeling you're gonna be able to pick up your size, no problem. And you'll be able to pick these up for 200. On March 31st, you're gonna have the women's Dunk Low Team Red dropping. Much like the men's version, the women's version should sell out pretty quick as well. So you'll be able to pick those up for 100 euro. Also on the 31st, the Sakai and Nike Low Blazer is dropping in the black and white patent colorway. Like I talked about in the US releases, I don't really see these going off. They look nice enough, they just don't have the hype behind them. So uh, pick them up for personals for sure. Uh, you'll be able to pick those up for 120 euro. Also on the 31st, you have the Air Jordan 3 uh, Mousseline dropping. I talked about this in last week's US releases. This particular colorway is not for me, maybe not the colorway per se, but more of the material that they're using in that colorway. I just don't like a canvas Jordan 3. When they charge you that premium price, I expect premium materials. So maybe they will surprise me with these. Maybe I'll get them, uh, review them. Maybe guys let me know if you want, want to see those reviewed, but I just don't have the desire to, to wear them or, or buy them for a personal. So I hope you guys like them. You know, everybody, you know, to, to is his own, but for me, it's a no-go. And to round us off on the first is the Air Jordan 1 Mid Dark Teal Green. I put this on here because it's actually an interesting colorway. Uh, the, the, the mixture, as you can see down here, at the bottom. It's just a really nice pop. I don't know what it is. I don't know. I know it's a mid, of course, but um, 
I don't think it's going to fly off the shelves by any means, but it's a actually interesting colorway. So I put that on here for this week's release. That's going to round us off for this week. I hope you guys enjoy this content and please consider subscribing and following. It really does mean a lot. It lets me know that what I'm putting out is what you guys like. And if you don't like it, please let me know what you would like to see. I want to make sure that the audience enjoys it. So until next time, have a great week.